All these clones, we the original. Then she tell mommy one time, she say, yeah, I say, I believe rap eat your marriage papers. <laughs> 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 Children, that's the last thing we want to do. We don't want to scare anybody. The tourists come over to chill on the beach, but they don't come over the hill where we sleep. We got nightmares and they got fantasies. No sanity, it's just insanity. My mommy hoping nothing happens to me. So we recording now. Yeah, I can just let you get set up. We recording all of you. This is a very prestigious day where we're gonna do something great. We out on the town. We gotta take it all the way back to them days when we was outside and you know feeling those bumpy roads as we went, go through the city. Go from West on West Bay Street to East Bay Street, over the hill, down on to Blue Air Road, East Street, down all the way to the south on to Kamika Road. And then, you know, you go wherever you need to go from there. Welcome to another episode of Everything Cool. This is the usual host, the host with the most, the Negus of Nassau, St. Antoine Alexander, Laura Jalen Willard. And I'm joined today by two beautiful women. First, we have Miss Selena Ocho. And please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Selena. I've been here before. Yeah, she has very been familiar. here before. She's very familiar. <laughs> we actually recorded in that yard. When it was, I think it's last September. It could have been. Yeah, it's could last September last because September. you was the episode we did before we went to Miami. So. Oh yeah, when y'all left me in Nassau. <laughs> when, when we could travel. <laughs> <laughs> when we could travel, and then we have another new face. We have Miss Cartwright. Please introduce yourself. Hi, hi all. I'm Sherelle Cartwright, owner of Mama Sassy's Gourmet Foods. Okay, that's cool, that's and cool. I'm just hanging with you all. I'm so glad you all invited me out on the town to party. <laughs> <laughs> so much Car- I've been in the house for so long, mm. you know what I mean? I mean, I get a little fix up a little dollop and things, you know? Yeah, of course. <laughs> so on this show, we have a very important segment. And we like to call this segment the Bayman word phrase or saying of the day. Now, since you're new to this, you could go ahead and choose the word saying or phrase of the day. Choose the word that... Any Bayman word phrase or saying you want to make the Bayman word phrase or saying of the day, I give that choice to you. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, the what? first thing is in my mind, uh, you know, I really didn't want to say. Okay. But let's use Kapon Kalup. Kapon Kalup. What, so what yes. Kapon ka, Kalup mean? What does that mean for, the, for mean? the international audience? What, do, what does Kapon Kalup mean? Kapon Kalup means when you mess right up. Mess right up. When you all throw piecemeal together. Mm. Kapon Kalup means when you just try to... R- even rigging up stuff. So kapunkal up being when everything ain't together, but you think you're together. Okay, so and you just a hot mess. Mm. You kapunkal up. All right. So <laughs> is that is that just naturally induced, or that's more so self-induced? I think that's kind of uh, more self-induced because you know you have plenty of people who don't know they kapunkal up. They think they <laughs> so a kapunkal up is. <laughs> Sure, I feel personally attacked. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, a good point, that's good, that's good, that's good. So, Selena, I give it over to you. Selena is co piloting with me. we about to take off. She's in the passing. What she calls shotgun. We have Miss Cartwright in the back, and we about to, you know, cruise along. I got to watch the road. So we are, there you go. we are, we, we going, we going riding, but before we go riding, mm-hmm. I need to um, do something real quick with, with Miss Sherelle. Okay. Sherelle, you know how I ride on my pink Moscato, right? 
Uh huh. I think I'm gonna need to order some more, and I have to go on our like mobile assist app and just make sure we get yeah, that sorted before I go out. Because I don't know, like I know because it is COVID nineteen time. Mm-hmm. I pack my little snack bag. The snack bag. Mm-hmm. So I have some like rotisserie roast chicken in there, and you know I like pink masato. Yeah, rotisserie roast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I know you probably could tell me it don't go with that, but I like it. So you think I could like I gonna just order off the app real quick? And you could order off the app, but guess what? I got you covered. I always travel in with my goodie bag. So here, you get it? Oh. Magic, oh my goodness. Yo, we don't we, play. We don't no, play. We, don't we play. have the secret we ready. sauce. <laughs> I like we ready. Yo. But you know what the beauty of this is? Even on oh, that's my you see even the dog's excited? That's yes. bingo Justin. <laughs> bingo. <laughs> yeah, bingo sauce. So- Bingo thought he saw sorcery just now. <laughs> Some of this. this is taking so hard for me to give away. Like, I got a sample yesterday from Mama Sassy's, right? Okay. I was super happy because I was just rolling, rolling, rolling down the street. And then I met Mr. Bishop Hancho, who signed up for Mobile Assist to donate for um, Great Commissions. We have a donate feature on the app with Mobile Assist. Mm-hmm. And that was all well and good. But, you know, they do such great work. They do... Um, they do the feeding. They do the housing of persons. They do the um, clothing size. Yes, That's all cool. of those things. And I was looking at my sample and I said, like, God, I ain't going to be pleased if I don't give my mama sassy sample of my favorite, absolute favorite flavor, which is the pink Moscato. And I, pink you know, Moscato. when you, you kind of want to hold it to your heart and be like, <gasps> and then God say, just let it go. So I gave that to Bishop Hansel today. So I'm so happy to get this one back. So and that's it forward, eh? <laughs> I always have my stuff, my supplies on hand. That's good. That's good. You know, I'm a real girl scout. Nice, yeah. <laughs> and y'all, 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 y'all work them wonders too. To where? So let me see. If I put my hand right here, what am uh-huh. I gonna pull back out? You ain't pulling nothing because I whatever coming this way, coming this way. I can get it before you. <laughs> so so you know co- what I. I really love, sorry, Justin, I know I was the co-pilot, but you know, I talk plenty. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Um, I know, <laughs> I know like um, one of the things that like um, Mobile Assist really loves about Mama Sassy is, is the fact that she is truly, truly Bahamian. Mm-hmm. Product source, all of her ingredients source from the natural soils that we so love, especially when we think about COVID, which reminds me, we have to put our masks on as we travel along this virtual night out. Yes. Um, but, you know, Mama Sassy's is such a great brand for Mobile Assist because it really just embodies everything that Mobile Assist stands for, which is a Bahamian startup company, tech, tech that can like literally mirror global in terms of the quality of what it is that Mobile Assist offers. But as Mama Sassy's, she was one of the first people to sign on with um, Mobile Assist. And when I saw her product and tasted her product, it was over. It, it was, was done. Good. Thank you. So I just hope I just hope you don't be getting too attached to the pink Moscato jam. <laughs> I feel like you thinking that you were really, 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 really coming up, but the curfew. <laughs> <laughs> anything to keep my my anything to keep this safe. I can use every excuse in the book. <laughs> okay. So what other flavors um do you have? Okay, is it like um, flavor themed or uh, cocktail? Actually, theme? yes. We have six flavors right now with the pepper jam and jelly. Okay. So the pink Moscato, which is her favorite. Mm-hmm. I also have a mulled wine, um, pepper jelly. And the mulled wine is uh, red wine uh, with spices. And um, I turned that. It's a... It's a uh, Seasonal drink in France and, and most Europe in the winter. Okay. Most most parts of Europe in the winter of the months. Um, you can buy it on the street. It's normally red wine, like I said, with spices. And, and you know, sometimes they throw a little brandy in there to give that, you know, to warm up your soul because it's cold outside. I see. And uh, it's been one of my favorite um, um, drinks for years. Uh, me going back and forth to France. And so... Um, actually, I fixed 
adopted here at home too from my family and friends in the Christmas. You okay. know, so that's one of my, even though it's not as cold as it is in France. <laughs> yeah. It still warms the spirit. Man, listen, and it's so nice because when you're making it, it smells up the whole house, gives it all that cinnamon and spicy flavor um, and fragrance. I, I mean, it's it's my favorite. And it's also my number one seller, um, my best seller. I also make um, a jelly out of the Calic there. Out of the Calic. Is Calic sponsoring you in, in any fashion? Well, they gave me some of my products. They gave me a few papers. <laughs> um, however, we will be renegotiating shortly. Okay. Because um, I wanted to uh, get some other stuff out of the way before I really started to um, engage them. Market my product out there. Okay, that's good. Um, I also do, um, I make a jelly out of the Calic Mango Rattler too. Oh, nice. And that one is like a great dipping sauce on your like your Asian inspired dishes, like your egg rolls and all of that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, I do a spicy apple jam, okay, which tastes like apple pie. I do a spicy cranberry jam. I also, I think that's what we got the apple, we got the cranberry, we mm-hmm. got the mulled wine, we got the pink moscato. We got the Calig Bear. We got the Calig Mango Rattler. I also do a Guinness Glaze. Yeah. Man, you do, it's man. You must see. You got the whole liquor store in your house. <laughs> well, but the thing is, you know, by the time as I'm, 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 I'm done cooking it, all mm. the alcohol is out of it. So mm. it's it's fine for, you know. Everyday kids consumption. To, it's not, yeah, it's not, um. It's not alcoholic. The alcohol content is totally um, evaporated out of it in the cooking process. But you do get the flavor. Okay, that's so good. So I that's do a good. Guinness glaze, which is great with jerk. I mm. also have um, two pepper sauces. Um, a pepper sauces slash marinade. So you can use it on your food like hot sauce, or you can use it to marinate your meats. One is a... Uh, Mango medley, which is mango carrots and uh, pineapples. And then the other one is the papaya medley, which is papaya, rosemary, and Spanish thyme. The rosemary and the Spanish thyme um, I grow in my yard as well as the papaya. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. So we Yeah, cook- and also the papaya one won mm. an award at the Choo Choo Bahamian Festival. Nice. Uh, yes. So we won an award there. And so that was pretty interesting uh, for us. All right. That's good, man. Uh, so as I always used to be thinking, is jam just for bread? But no, then man. as I got older. No, no, no. You could no, put no, no, jam no. on anything. Is it, that, that is so interesting. That, you Trust know. me, we're, we're, we're getting ready to put out some recipes with our jams. We partnered with uh, one of the um, places that partnered with us so far to um, create uh, menu items using our products is uh, on Betty's Kitchen. Mm. And uh, they came up with two dishes that I, can I tell you, I mean, oh, it blew me nice. away. It blew That's me away. It was just so delicious. It was a lobster um, dish called the Kalikin crawfish. The Kalikin crawfish. And then there was another one called the Gombe salmon. And both were delicious. I mean, it was just top of the line. Delicious. I, I can uh, see. We have some, yeah, so don't worry. When, when we go on our real trip outside, all right. we definitely have to take you to our little hideaways. Okay. So you can appreciate and experience some I just have one disclaimer. That hopefully they have vegetarian options because I don't eat meat. <laughs> oh yeah, they do. They do. They, okay. they do have. They do have vegetarian options. Okay. Um, they, they do have a lot of. Uh, and also, um, we're gonna have some drinks. Ah, I guess. It- yeah, we're gonna have some drink recipes that you can use okay. with our products. <laughs> I see. Listen, I see. You know, That's Sam on the go, eh? That's the bar on the go with Samantha. Yes, yes. Bar <laughs> on the go with Sam. Sam is, Sam is in the right now concocting 
uh, some some mama sassy drinks. Okay. Yeah, I think we have like CA in every later. No, because we 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 driving. You gotta drive slow, you know. We gotta we, we gotta, gotta drive we can't, slow. I guess we can't break the speed limit. Yeah, but we so we, we pick it up. Is, we pick it up, Mr. Nuri, right now. Go ahead, okay. uh, Miss Carter. Hold on. Mm-hmm. Hold on, y'all didn't we'll in the car driving, but <laughs> yeah. y'all didn't give me nothing to wet my throat. <laughs> <laughs> Then y'all come pick people up. You're supposed to offer them. Well, some- you know, let me hold on. Stop, Sherelle, because you can't drink and drive. Pete, I didn't say the driver. All I say in driving, only one oh, person man. driving. Here, yeah, man. Here, yeah, go on. Take. Have a little sip. Thank you, but you're not. I don't do the beer. Yeah, you do the wine. You do the wine. Mr. Nuri. Yeah. Welcome. Yeah, see Got my glass of with you. I drink it too much now. The party started. Oh man! Body, A, you see him all fly up in his jacket. Uh, and his jacket, he come ready. <laughs> we in the party you know? scene. Now we just fix this computer. Okay. Oh, <laughs> So, you know, now they said two is a group, three is a crowd, but, you know, four is when the things really go up. <laughs> oh, about to get, wait, which y'all is called it, Justin? Because you're always the young people. What y'all to say? Litty. Litty. I know music. I know music in the car. I blame Justin. You know why I blame Justin? Because Justin is the we driver. No, we don't even have no nice vibing music. Nah, right? Nice vibing music. Man, I got See, we could do a next magic trick. I'm going to pass you this phone so you could go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's going into the screen. You pull, pull your phone up, pull your phone up. Now you could DJ. Mm. <laughs> so we have Mr. Nuri with us coming in. Well, he, he about to go get something, you know, make sure he right before he get in the car. But, you know, this is what it's about. We driving around slow. Drive slow while, you know, as the driver, you be, you be responsible. So I have my, you know, half a gallon of water. And while everybody you else, sure that's water? yeah, this water, man. This, this I, just... I know this water. As <laughs> the co-pilot, because I, I gotta make sure one everybody get home safe. <laughs> so, Mister Nuri, I like to navigate where we get. Mm-hmm. Well, me, I like to. I just like to be um, chauffeured. I see. I, I spur. see. Yeah. You spur. I spur. <laughs> spur like that. <laughs> and I know, like, one of our next stops is like we um, stops is with, that we're going by Green Parrot, mm-hmm. right? Because they're also on the app. So if we wasn't going like around the town today, if you were home and you needed to order some food, you'd get it from Green Parrot or drink, whatever Friday yeah. weekend. Why Thursday, my we, we on weekend. Friday, Junior. This Friday, Junior. Yeah, well, you know, you got one day, this day, the next day. COVID, I was all messed up with our days. Mm-hmm. Like, I have to say, like, it's, it's crazy. But Green Pirate, then definitely, like, you would actually go, like Mama Sassy's with Green Pirate, you could go to the mobile assist app and actually order the food and the beverages from Green Pirate. That's dope. So whether you want to go and take a little drive and pick it up, or you want them to deliver it to you. Like, you have all of those options. But the products are right there on the page. All you have to hit is the Shop Now button, which reminds me, before we go to Green Pirate, who all load their wallet? Or are you using my money today? My See money, here. stay stop up. Stay, no, take, no, stay no, top no, 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 no. See here, be, be old-fashioned. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I guess I pay for that. Because I certainly ain't going in mine. I don't have a problem with that. Old school, old school gal, all the way. Come on, Cal, you know, ain't no man taking me out on no date night paying that first date now. Uh, you know, you got to and CA, y'all needs to figure that out. Yeah, no, I look like Justin then. Justin say, come on, come, 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 let's go. So come, let's Justin, go. Like, you know, you got to split that bill, y'all uh, uh, needs to split that out. We'll split the bill. If I drive and yeah, I pay yeah, it. Yeah, but, um, <laughs> Well, I can tell you what I want now, okay? Before uh, we even get to Mr. Mori Place. Right? Green Parrot. Hold on. Let me go, let me put it through on that. Good. Because I can put my order in. My okay. order has to be in. Okay. Green Parrot on the screen. All right. Order now. Go ahead. Order now. All want? right. So, I want the nachos. The nachos. That's appetizers. Mm-hmm. That's the appetizers, right? Mm-hmm. Then I want the mahi-mahi because, you know, Mr. Mori is actually going there and fish. The mahi salad? Mm. The I want the mahi with the baked potato and the macaroni and cheese. 
all of that? <laughs> she hungry. <laughs> My it's wife. COVID. <laughs> wow. It's COVID. COVID got we you eat. hungry. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, that's entree. You got the entree. Six pack oh, to collect. And six pack. A six pack. That's just my order now. With Sherelle, we want that different. Okay. Well, you, you get me water, Sherelle? Yeah, what you mean? What you mean? You think I just ran here playing cute? You know, I know. I know. Hey, 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 now you know. Yeah. I got you now. I feel a little steakish, man. A little steakish. I want, I want me that T bone steak. That T bone. I want it um, medium well, please, because mm. I've been so sick and tired of eating all kind of fish and chicken and all that other kind of stuff, you know. No problem. You know, we got mind you. you. Mind you, them pork ribs look good too, you know. Mm. Make up your mind. Let's, Make let's, up your mind so I can send this. We ain't want to share this thing. We ain't want to just do some, get some sure. stuff. That'll be between three y'all because I don't eat right. meat. <laughs> well, because me and you is the meat eaters, then Sherelle, what you could do is I can share some of mine. You share some well, of yours. What you, have, what you have? What you having? So I have in the mai mai. I want no mai mai. I want no fish. But that. But I get. But I get into like the um the tacos. No, I want no tacos. <laughs> Well, then you must eat that pork chop bite. So you only want a T bone. Let me, let me, let me stick with my my steak then. I want the six ten ounce T bone steak, medium well. And I would just like um, a salad with that, please. What type of salad? A Caesar salad would be fine. Thank you. Caesar salad. Caesar salad. (laughs) Yes. Um, for the appetizer, I don't, I don't know if I really need an appetizer. Appetite. They My green part, green part food would be a lot. Is it for real? Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, you know, they get no, they get some curry, curry chowder, chowder. They have some curry kong chowder here. I think I want, I won't try that because I didn't try that. Okay. Curry kong chowder, just a little cup. I don't want a big bowl of that. And that's me. That's good. I ain't got a heavy order because I got to keep my eyes on the road. Justin, so. you need to order water. <laughs> <laughs> I know if my wallet can take this. My wallet can take this. Uh, no, we, we can, you can send me. I'll pay you half of the bill and you get the next half. That's why I say okay. my order ain't complicated. All I need is, you know, some flat bread and hummus and then add a Caesar salad to that and like a glass of water. Okay. I get, what you just do is you share off the plate, they just them when you're going out with people. Yeah. I can taste it. I can taste it. Okay. Yeah. And then you know what I actually, what I could taste too with that? Because I actually think. So. Yeah. Well, look who just called me. That's that's Mr. Maury now calling me. Let me mm-hmm. type. I was a friend in the car that always got the calls and type of things. Like, can I send this food order? That's Mr. O. This, 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 you all order going in? Yes. Yeah? Send it. You must send it. Send it. Send it. Oh, everything out the cart ready. Uh, I'm pressing send. Okay. And let's ready, go pick it up. For. Just need to pick it up. All right. So, All right. Let me I type in now. Yes. Yeah, so Even the, though they, they get that notification right away, Mr. Mori must have, he must have felt that he was coming. <laughs> yes. So we going to feel it. Since we in Zoom, we go on Zoom, Zoom, Zoom on the road and enter, and pull up to Mr. Mori. Well, he came back out. All right, let's wait for him. That's going to take it a little further, but I hope you all, you know, I like to be, imagine myself like I'm a flight, uh, f- a flight attendant or more so like a pilot. So I'd be like, you know, keep your arms in the car. You know, fasten your seatbelt. You know, make sure you have the right, you know, posture, get comfortable. You know, look at everybody, greet everybody. You know, and then we forget the mask because, you know, we supposed oh, to be six Lord. feet apart. <laughs> what is that? Ten thousand dollars? That's a ten thousand dollar fine. Okay, all right. So all right guys, I have one. Janae's is actually giving us masks. They're another client of mobile assist. And they have these masks available on the app as well that you could purchase. You could mm-hmm. pick it up from the store when you purchase it, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hand everybody their masks. So we be because I don't have ten thousand dollars, I don't know about y'all. I can't even I can't even pay for all our green pirate stuff. So I don't have ten thousand. <laughs> <laughs> so hold on Alright, so Justin That's you Alright Thank you Got it Yeah Perfect Alright let, let me try this on I like this color I like this color Hold on, hold on. Ah, look at that uh, Look at that <laughs> What color is that? A pink? Uh, yeah, I like the pink yeah. so Be got, a man wear pink Yeah, so you know You see My shirt little <laughs> floral So I need a floral mask You know, and then I got an accent Everybody else in the group So 
Miss Kyrie wearing pink with pink lipstick, so you know that match it. You wearing a little bit blue, Mr. Nuri. So, you know, gotta match that. And Selena, we color blocking, so you know, the blue could go with thing. I got, you know, white pants on. So, you know, that all blend up together. Well, you, you stay fresh. Like, you, you stay sad. All right. Uh, now, we can give. Prime example. Mama Tassis, you ready? <laughs> you, you, you get your mask or you can go? She has some mask. Uh, Oh. All right, she ain't need that then, but what the do you get? All right, Thanks. there you go. There you go. Okay, it still has a tag on it. Yes, it has a tag on it. Tags on everything. Tags on everything. Tags on everything. It's not a bad price too, Janae's. This, this is I'm nice. Wearing, I wear in mine the wrong way. Oh, okay. I, I, no, you had it. They're actually right? interchangeable. Actually, it is? So, like... Mine has, like, my mask here has, uh, I don't know it comes across backwards on the camera, oh. but it has the Janaeus logo, it has the Mobile Assist logo, because they also do the embroidery. Okay. And so I could turn it, like, especially because we're on ghost moves today, and I don't want ghost nobody brought me. Mm-hmm. I could do it like that, and then I get Oh, that's nice. But what I like about this for the ladies See, look at mine. Mine is, that is two tones. So, I mean, I have a solid mm-hmm. blue on one side, yeah. Why and then I have mm-hmm. a floral on the other. Okay. Oh, so okay. I mean, it's clashing with my pink, you know, but I mean, yeah, see, I, I, I put him a bligh on that one, you know. <laughs> I see. <laughs> so, I like you know, it. You got to be versatile, you know, versatile. I mean, the, uh-huh. with, with, the, with the pink, the color of the ocean and the plants sort of men with each other a little bit. So, you know, you and thing. <laughs> All right. So we pulling up. To Mr. Murray, welcome, Mr. Murray. He's joining in. So, uh, you know, we have any more space in the car or this uh, SUV? Because, you know, we can't, we got to. Well, we got to go by Mr. Murray because we picking up, you know, we picking up our stuff from Mr. Murray. All right. And Mr. Murray's a busy man. He doesn't have time to be riding around with us. <laughs> today. <laughs> <laughs> right. I, Mr. I Murray, could, I could, you can turn on your camera. Yeah, sure. I just do I have to have a mask and all that stuff on? No, no, you're <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm in my office. Hang on a second. Well, you're safe. You're safe. You're very safe. Like, you know, we, we, we're practicing social distancing. So we out. Uh, start video? Is it start video? Yes. Okay, there. Yeah. Okay, hello. Uh, <laughs> Welcome to the show. It's kind of a mask. Man, that's fine. That's fine. You know, COVID brings us together. So we, you know, having a virtual night on the town. Selena, well, Mr. Nuri put in our order, so we just had to pick up. It is a quite a hefty order. And <laughs> as usual, Mr. Mori, um, the ladies have ordered the most food. Of course, <laughs> because um, Justin and um, CA have loaded their wallets with their credit and debit cards. They figured that they would cover us because they're gentlemen and they want to be old food today. So, <laughs> sounds great. You're ordering for all of us. <laughs> right, yeah, we, we did order a little extra. You're all hitting this way while it's hard. Oh, uh, <laughs> but that's the beauty of mobile assist, then, Justin. Yeah. Because all yes. you have to do is put all you have to do is load it back up again, unless. That's but if your debit card don't work, I know you're good for your credit, so yeah, you should. This, this is my second time to go into Green Park uh, in in two days. This. Yesterday was real, and this is now virtually, so this is good. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy Green Power food. It was easy, too. It was just easy. Just yeah. tap, 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 send. And, you know, Mr. Mori catches his own fish uh, for the restaurant as well. So all of that fish that is um, on the menu is caught well, I wanna, by the owner's hand. It was just brought to my attention th- in this conversation that I didn't ever knew we had mahi, mahi, and the Yes. Yeah. Yes. I, I never heard about that before. That's, yes. Like, where you go to catch them? Like, is there a specific, like, air body of water? Or? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, we have, I mean, we have some of the greatest fish in, in, in I mean, this time of year, May, Cat Island, uh, Long Island, Rumkey, mm. all those marinas down there. Um, uh, well, even, even our marine, obviously, you know, we have a lot of sport fishes that come through Bahamas, but. They have, we have tournaments here. I mean, Walker's Key Chronicles, and uh, I, forget, um, I forget their date, but I think uh, Walker's Key is reopening. 
Um, obviously, you know, Bimini was always a Hemingway's big, uh, you know, I mean, he wrote books there about um, blue marlin fishing and yeah. obviously mahi. We have a lot of pelagic species, uh, you know, migrate through the Bahamas. You, well, not year round, but, you know, this particularly March, April, May, because obviously I run a marine as well. It's, it's like our busiest time of the year, you know? So, Cooling. well, right now is mut mutton fish, though. So that's what I, I went to go do that. And then we had a few mechanical problems. So I was a little late getting in. I just told Selena. So, but no, nope. we were able to get some other snappers. Um, but I did see a big blue marlin running back when I was running in. So. Yeah. And how long does it take to catch a marlin, Mr. Maureen? Like, is it like the books where the line goes out? Because the last time I did some fishing, I actually had a line. And when I went, I guess you call it the casting, it hooked up in a tree. So I never actually got to the water. Uh, okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, <laughs> you know, I mean, blue marlin fishing is a little different because you're, you know, you're out off the edge, typically a thousand feet, you know. Um, you know, you like to get out quite a ways and, and it's mainly you're trolling. So, you know, you troll yeah. bait and some people use live bait. Um lures and all kinds of stuff it's, it's pretty uh i've done quite a bit of it all through the bahamas and uh it's it's pretty amazing i mean i've got you know more than 500 pounds you know i think i think wow. the atlantic record actually was set in the bahamas wow but typically you know i talk about blue marlin because obviously that's our national fish but you know they eat mahi so mm. I didn't realize That's that. That's interesting. I had no idea. That's a new oh, yeah. and, You know, yeah, I think it's just awesome that they're on the menu at Green Parrot, like, you know, fresh caught fish. Yeah. Like, that is yeah. just so amazing. Again, it goes back to just being um, kind of more Bahamian economy minded what about how it is that we're running our businesses. I started the restaurant, to be honest, you know, 30 years ago, I, um, when I was running Hurricane Hole, I'd go, you know, spearfish and lobster uh snapper mahi i did a lot of deep sea fishing and and you know obviously we had burgers and beers it was just kind of a a little bar over at hurricane hole on Friday island and the catch of the day and and cheeseburgers and you know cold beers that was the the whole concept it was pretty simple fast casual you know i was just out of college. yeah that you know, was the that was the new thing fast casual so that's that's what we were I was trying to do when I started the whole thing. Obviously, it's grown into, you know, a full service restaurant. Yeah. Originally, that, that's how it started. Yeah, because Green Pirate has a, like been a somewhat instrumental place in my like teenagers coming into adulthood. Like you know, going, like you know, going there from, like coming out of high school, and that was like over ten years ago. To like yeah. you know, becoming a young professional and like Green Pirate always has been a staple. Of that whole journey. We start. We started with, yeah. on Paradise Island, you know, and then that was all we. It was going to get redeveloped actually um, when it lands and uh, so that's why we opened this one. And then that one didn't close, so I ended up with two, which was never supposed. That's why you know you have Green Parrot Nassau and Green Parrot Paradise Island. Yeah, that's amazing, man. That's amazing. So and you know what I can't wait for, Justin mm -hmm. and and um, Cheryl and Ca is when we can finally gather around an actual table, look out at the harbor, watch the water, and have these meals. Yeah. Instead of having to take it and eat it in the car or eat what? it at home. Peter uh. has to take us on the boat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I ain't sitting on no dock. We're not I, I, yeah. fishing. We could be trolling. We could go down to the Exuma Keys and stuff where all of them, be all you could catch all of them on the way there. So Peter, we gonna need to arrange this this fishing trip. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I got a smaller go boat now, but I did at one point have a charter boat. We used to do that. We would take people out, they catch the fish, we bring them back, feed them. It was a big. Uh, that was Paradise Island, and I got busy with everything else, and you know, I kind of got out of that part of it. But, because you also have the Bay Street Marina, right? Like you have the full slips now that yeah. um, has been yep. developed. Yep. We so got, and uh, that's huge. Yeah, we're, we're right now, I mean, we've already developed two-thirds of downtown so with docks. Wow. And obviously, no upland development. Obviously, we're hoping that comes. But um, the boardwalk, you know, from what, what we've done across our properties is pretty much uh, goes to, from right here. At, at, you know, we're right next to the RBDF base. So basically, the, the new bridge 
all the way down to Victoria Avenue and poured the cement and put the cheap island in. So, you know, it's growing. And the idea is to have, you know, more retail. And um, mm -hmm. it's kind of a, you know, it was it was a dream, but now it's like, I don't even, it doesn't, it doesn't even seem real anymore. You know, I mean, it's, it's, we've been doing it and building it. It's great, you know, but now you, like, you know, we're still, I was down there with the construction company today and, you know, you look at it and you're just like, man, when, when's everybody going to be able to see this again? I know. I, I just want to put it out there. Um, Mr. Neri, now that you know that the marina is also available and that all of this downtown development is going on, I expect to see a post. Oh, definitely. Um, yeah, of course. I, I love Green Parts. I have a history with Green Parts, so I definitely advertise and promote as much as possible because I guarantee to have good food, no matter what. I, I, I can actually say everything on Green Parts menu is good and using mobile app to order before i reach is always good man mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but also justin wants a boat it's my massage too now so yes you, yes mm -hmm. and you mr maury peter i'm gonna need to come and see you after this COVID thing is over so we could sit down and discuss my mama my massage product line yeah okay. and how we can incorporate into that into some of your menus that's mm, we that's we what we all that. about. That's what we all about. Connections, connections. Working now, so you know we having fun, but you know you got to drop and you got to drop in that plug for business. Bro. We've always you know? been we've always been a Bahamian owned and Bahamian run company, you know, and and you know obviously a lot of the stuff that we try to do here is promote Bahamian products. I buy from the local fishermen and stuff, and now with BAIC, we're buying. Um, you know, they have the produce boxes and stuff we buy produce yeah. from them so it's it's all the whole idea is you know the, the whole group is developing downtown the Bahamian too so I mean it is to is to be despite what some people think is is to be you know kind of a a way a place that people come and see all kinds of unique products you know yeah absolutely so, that's I think we're, that's one of the sorry all right I think that's one of the things that um, both Korean Parrot and Mama Sassy's have in common is the fact that they do purchase from Bahamians as well in order to produce what they do produce and serve Bahamians um, their different products. So I think that that, again, I'm all for Bahamian economy and making sure that we strengthen it. Justin, I know you share that sentiment. CIA, yeah. CIA I know you, said, you share that as well. Mm -hmm. It is just so amazing to be on a ride with just people that that value our country the way that you guys have and the fact that you are local businesses i think that that is just fantastic sorry i i i, I get excited about this type of stuff so Thank yeah that's us. but that's what it's all about you know sharing uniting connecting you know even through this time where we have to socially distance from one another we find new ways to connect mm -hmm. so you know yeah it's funny Mr. Mori, I know we we kind of kind of dropped into you, and we don't want to keep too much more because you have a lot going on. Mm -hmm. We don't want to keep you too much longer, but thank you so much for I like just, just dropping in with us. That's what I want to know. The fish is true. <laughs> <laughs> Would you ask? Would... I'm a real island girl now. Don't mind the cute face. I love. <laughs> I love being on the boat. Trust me, I know how to bottom fish, deep fish. I know how to troll too. Oh, trust I'll me. I'll like get seasick. I can teach you the rest. Oh, no, no, no. You already know that's an advantage. Trust me, I have a cast iron stomach. People are mm. That's all you need. The rest is easy. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> But thank you so much. Even if you don't fish, if you just sit there and watch it, it's pretty. It's a pretty ma amazing thing to see mm -hmm. what we have right here. And you know, I mean, part of the reason, obviously, I, I mean, I go out to feed the restaurant, but the rest of it is, you know, the main reason for me is just to get away from some of the craziness that goes on in our oh, daily. Yeah. An amazing thing to look at, you know. I mean, the fish, the sea life, everything. So. Love it. But that's amazing. So, Mr. Amari, we thank you for, you know, joining, popping in. We come in to, you know, grab our food. And yep. until next time we see each other in person. Well, 
Well, hopefully it'll be sooner than later. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> I can't take any more of these extensions. Extensions, <laughs> yeah. Nor, nor can we. Nor yeah. can we. We we like if we had our way, we would have been right there with you today. Mm-hmm. Well, we're ready. In Green you know, Barrett. We put in all. You know, we, we we've set it up with the protocols that we've got based on you know world pra- world industry practices for the restaurants. Even though we're not allowed to open, I mean, we we put the you know, separated the tables and we put I see the that. stickers mm-hmm. down. Yeah. Well, I see that. That's all. Yeah. Awesome. So, that's, and, that's and, the, and, the, and the physical distancing. When I went there yesterday, you actually had a place to stand and yeah. place your yeah. order. So that, all that is there. Well, we, 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 I mean, even though we haven't, you know, officially got word from, you know, our government, we, you know, we're trying to be, you know, step ahead and say, yep. you know, Proactive. look at what everybody else is doing. So we're doing that. And, you know, we put sanitizers in and everything else. I mean, I don't know what our Ministry of Health is going to require us to do to reopen. But, you know, I figure if I can do all of, all of what everybody else is doing now to show that we're willing to make these steps to get, you know, get the staff back in and get the customers back in, then hopefully, you know, the government will say, well, these guys are pretty serious about what they're, you know, keeping people safe. So, you know, let's try it, you know. If it doesn't exactly. work, then, you know, I guess it and then- extended another month. I don't know, but at least... We have our mask for when it is that we can still come down. Yes. See our, our branded mask. We have the proudly oh, sponsored. I wear it around because I'm, you know, I'm outside the marina most days, and you know, I'm relied to open. So I mean, I'm, I just wear it around my neck. It's simple. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it also is useful to be like uh. when you hot, you could like fan yourself off a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you have enough flashes, Justin. No, I mean I under this hot light, but you know, just making sure like the thing go, you know. But you got to be re- resourceful, so either you know you use it as a mask or a little fan, you know. <laughs> carry stuff. Yeah, carry stuff. Yes, you do. <laughs> Mr. Mori, I'm sure that um, Sherelle will be definitely coming to see you soon. She is a woman of her word with Mama Sassy. Great. So, that I um, many times. Green Heart used to be my stomping ground before I went underground and just was staying home trying to work on my products, you know. Yep. I used to be there just about every Friday, every other Friday mm-hmm. night with my crew. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, was a, it was a fairly popular spot for that. It's a great, it's a great setting. You know, I mean, we have one of the largest natural harbors in the Caribbean, and there's nothing, you know, there's nothing better than to be out here on the water. I mean, the waterfront, and, and you know, I mean, even in these times, you know, just doing what I'm doing, I, you know, I still appreciate it. Mm-hmm. It's a, uh, it kind of, you know, it's calming a little bit. <laughs> Besides everything else. I know. <laughs> Drives me crazy. It's very, it's, it's very uh, stressful time. Yeah. yeah. It is, and I, I think that that's why, um, even like being able, like it saved us a lot. Like um, even with my partner and myself, like it is hard being home all day in the house together, and like even basic chores get a little bit yeah. stressful. So being able to pick up that, um, pick it up on mobile assist and just order it. Like sometimes that is our ride for the day. Yeah. Because we can't go anywhere yeah. else. And you know what I mean? We just we order it, we pick it up, and then when we get home, we're like doing a little happy food dance because we you know, happy food dance. It, it is it is something that just makes <laughs> life a little bit easier. So thank you so much for you know coming on to the mobile assist app. Yes. Well thanks for having me and thanks for all you've done. I mean it's it's definitely mobile mobile assist has helped us out tremendously, you know, to help us service the customers and we just you know i mean we, we're trying to do everything we can just to make this whole thing go as easy as possible for you know people that are stuck mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And trying to get you know some of our employees that are you know i mean i also in margaritaville and obviously the one on friday's on i mean, got a lot of people right now that are, you know depending on us to come back on stream so this is this has enabled us to stay operating somewhat you know just to keep the just to keep the energy going you know so hopefully when when things get better then you know we can open everything so. and we can't wait totally for that day it's gonna be a yeah, setup, me, right? we'll, me either <laughs> <laughs> mr mori again thank you so much um yes. for having us and hosting us we really do appreciate you thank you very much 
All right. All right. Have a great day. Great day. Take care. Take care. See you guys in the boat. All right. (laughs) (laughs) We got to wait for the PM to open up, open up first, but. Listen, just say when. I'll be I, there. <laughs> I will be there. I need a break right about now. And I'm telling you, the water is calling at this time. And it's getting warmer, too. I tell you, it's, you know, yeah. summer's coming. It's, you know, you're going to need to get out to the water. So. Mm-hmm. Well, take care, everybody. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you. Bye, Mr. Thank you. Okay, bye. bye. All right. So... That I had was, no idea, like, we had thought it was um, started just based on Mr. Mori's fishing business. Like, that is yeah. super interesting. Yeah. You yeah, learn something new every day. Yeah, and, I didn't know that. Yeah, and yeah. now everything comes full circle, because I remember, like, you know, being in high school, going to Green Pirate, you know, when you get off from work, all the times I've already been there on, like, a Friday afternoon or a Thursday afternoon. Oh, yeah, that, that's and, a you know, black boy. And, I, you know, it's cool to meet the owner. Of the whole, you know, the creator of everything, and you know, we meet, we meet the creators of everything. You know, the, the originals, the original mm-hmm. people, and we mm-hmm. we just trying to make everything, everything cool. <laughs> I used to get plenty problems in Green Bar. I might as well tell you. <laughs> I don't want to know what those problems you will get. Into. Oh man! I don't even want to know what it is. Sure, I'll probably tell you later, but we don't have such a big audience. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Miss Goody Two Shoes, though. Oh, man. So I think. I can see the comments ping, 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 and Selena. Selena. Goody Two Shoes. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, Lord. No. People, I always tell ah. people, um, you know, that, that there was a poem called um, um, The Girl with the Strawberry Curl right in the middle of her forehead. When she was good, she was very, very good. But when she was bad, she was horrid. Mm. Yeah. I, Who could you be talking about? I don't know. But well, you know, I think I own the rights to that for many a years. But I'm thinking you, I can share the rights oh, to Lord. that. <laughs> I take it as a compliment because it makes us interesting people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You just say CA. Yeah. I agree. I smile still. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I know. I, I know Cheryl from school. She was bad then. Now define that bad now, because you know you're oh, too kind of bad. I, I, no comment. Too kind of bad. I, can, I allow you to go explain that's like two type of bad. <laughs> two type of bad. When they say they feisty, she is feisty. feisty. Yes. She, she was hot <laughs> like you had to, you had to, you know. Yes, you can hear them out. Mm. You know the brand is named Mama Sassy's for a reason though, right? I see that. Yeah, I, see I that. need to take advantage of that. So I'm going to push this. Uh-huh. And uh, I definitely. A million dollars if y'all could tell me who gave me the name for that. Wow. Yeah. You sure you want to give a million dollars away? Because a million dollars because if you it have to be like right now because I'll Google that. Uh, yes. You tell me you <laughs> Google that. You try Google who give me that name for me. I, I gotta figure out who you know you. Was it your them. best friend or your mother? Someone who tell me. CA, go put that on Facebook now. See if we can get an answer before yes. this podcast over. <laughs> yeah, I, I do that. I'm good for that. <laughs> I'm good for that. No man. But you know, I ordered a prescription. I wonder if it's ready yet. Oh, yes, we, um, we gotta make on it mobile assist, stuff. we have like um, Southside Pharmacy. Yeah. So, like you know, yeah, my my Grammy needs her little things, like her little prescriptions and stuff, and she can't go to the store. And you know, with with everything happening, so with them being on the app, I literally could just go and order, and then do the bill pay with mobile assist, pay them, and then just they'll bring it out to the car for me, and then I good. Nice. Or I could go in and I could scan and pay. Mm-hmm. Which means I just take my phone and I read them. We'll show how to do that. But it's just like, it's so simple. Like, I don't have to touch my wallet. Which, to be honest with me, especially how we riding around today, it's probably better if I don't trust, like, because I'll lose something. Mm. My phone, I always just have at the end of the night. But at least I could keep my money on my phone. I agree. I agree. Uh, one thing I like with mobile uh, assist is when I go to these um, cultural functions, I don't mm-hmm. take money anywhere. I just grab my, my, my phone and just swipe going in and then swipe to every stop, every, every stop. So that's, that, that's good for me. I tell you, Mr. Simon from Jay, because, you know, Jay is also on the app. They do the donation um, platform. 
Mm-hmm. Mr. Simon went um, to, I think it was True True Bahamian Festival when we first launched Scan and Pay nice. for Mobile Assist. Nice. All he is, ping, 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 yes. ping, because he, he had a teenage daughter with him, his teenage daughter. So, you know, I don't oh, know so how phone. much money that was spelled, like spent, but um, Mr. Simon didn't have to leave that function once. Yes. He I, kept I, loading and loading and loading. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Can I throw the shade? You could go. No. <laughs> the SAC Alumni Association yes, is. Yes, I send money there too. That, that's as great. well. And we're joined now by Mr. McIntosh from the pharmacy. Outside neighborhood pharmacy. Outside neighborhood. <laughs> Get it, get it. Mr. McIntosh, you come right in time to save me from a rowing. I know, right? <laughs> he was just about to jump on me. Right. <laughs> what's up? What's up? So, so Selena came to pick up a prescription for her grandmother, and she came yeah. to the best. And I've already paid through the app, so I know that my package is just ready for me to just pick up and collect. I, you know, it's just so great to be able to be able to get like the medication and stuff. And even after COVID, I think I'm, I'm definitely going to be able to use the service because as busy professionals, like we run it around all the time anyway, and just being able to pay and pick up. I, I like that. And then for you, Mr. McIntosh, it means that before you even start processing your order, you already have that payment right in your hand. Right. It's such a easy process, like, because Southside, we recently launched our mobile uh, mobile prescription service. Mm-hmm. And so it makes it so much easier for persons to call in, send us a WhatsApp. I can price it whilst I'm dealing with a patient right in front of me. Um, I could give them their account. I get the message to come across my phone and say paid. By the time that patient comes in, prescription is ready. So it's, it's very convenient for us um, as a business going into like a new area and it's definitely convenient for our patients because it's literally no wait time. We can do all the counseling, all of the information, the payment. So when you come in, you like you saw during the height of COVID those long lines outside of the pharmacies. Mm-hmm. With uh with our with our mobile assess, you literally can say we we are here and you catch your prescription and leave. It's literally no wait time. And that's what I love about that. That's dope. That's that dope. was one of the things that I loved as well, because I think I've been traumatized by COVID lines everywhere. Right. And so anywhere that doesn't have a line or that I don't have to wait for. Nice. Yeah. It's like anytime I see a line now, I think for the next, let's say, year or two years, I think I'll automatically just bypass. Cause I can't take it. I, I, it was just, it was just a new experience for me. I felt like I was in some type of version of the Hunger Games. Type right. Version. And <laughs> when it first started, I was like, was "What crazy. are these lines about?" And I mean, and for us, because you know, pharmacy is an essential service. It was literally vitamin C. Persons wanting to buy, they get six. I need this. It's like you don't need all, all of like, this. Yeah. <laughs> but it was literally a fight for survival during that time. <laughs> But with mobile assist, you literally did not have to go through that because you pay through the app and you get your stuff taken right to you. And it isn't just prescription meds, it's anything we sell, you can actually buy through the app. Toilet paper as well. So wow. you, you know, that was a hot item. Yeah. That was did like, you, did you run it? Right. <laughs> right. What's some of the other yeah. things yeah. that you have down there? Because, you know, when I come in, I just literally, first of all, I have to say, Carmichael people, what is going on? Y'all is drive definitely different. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> they, yeah. People in Carmichael is drive different? Yeah. It, like, well, it's out. East free, just like a Michael. It yeah. is a different. Yeah, it's the traffic is crazy. Yeah. But it's not the traffic course, so much. So, Mr. McIntosh is the driver. And anywhere in that southern area, I feel like I'm stepping into a set of the Wild Wild West sometimes. Yeah, it, it's, 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 it's what it is. It is what it so, is. when I'm coming to get the stuff from you, normally what I, I do is I try to focus on the road, get the stuff in, get what I need to get, get out real quick. Because um, I only have third party insurance, you know I'm balling. Well, <laughs> me too. Right, me too. I, I, I in there with you. Yeah. <laughs> so what? What like what? I never really take. I've taken the time to kind of look around. So tell me some of the other things that you have. Well, we are full service pharmacy, so any 
thing you can get from any other pharmacy, you could get from us. That's your over-the-counter items. It's like people now in COVID times, they stocking up on vitamin C, zinc, vitamin D, multivitamins by all different brands. We have our painkillers. We have household items. Like anything you get from a retail pharmacy, you kind of can get from us. And so, I think at the end of this, we need antidepressants. Well, we have uh, that too. We even have some <laughs> over-the-counter stuff that people could, could I use I now. Some natural <laughs> products. So, so yeah, we basically, whatever you think of, we can get to you. And the beauty of it is that you don't even have to come in our store. You can mm-hmm. just WhatsApp us. We can tell you we do carry it. We tell you the price. You pay through mobile assist and you can get your stuff because we do deliver as well. So, so yeah. Yep. Give us that um, WhatsApp number as well so that even, and I'm going to encourage people that if they, they do want to um, utilize your services, again, the delivery, the pickups, the scan and pay where they don't have to even have any contact with cash. I think that's important as well. Um, but give us your, your information in terms of your numbers so that we have the WhatsApp number. So, because, you know, I only get the prescriptions for Grammy now, but now I see it, there's other things that I should be Right. Covering. So, so <laughs> basically the easiest way is WhatsApp. 818-7946. And once you send us a WhatsApp, we check it regularly, we'll respond, and you get that one-on-one, just like a, just as though if you were in um, the pharmacy. So so yeah, that's the way to go now. Mr. McIntosh, I have a question. And I have a question for CA and I have a question for Sherelle. Justin, I don't know, like I know. You're a little younger than us, so I can ask you the same question. Now you gotta ask me. I I I don't even look young, but I oh like like a hundred years old. I just keep myself nice. That's all. (laughs) But um, we were talking today. We had the Bahamian word of the day for everything cool for the Mm. podcast for the original People Network. I already know how this gonna go. (laughs) And then um, no, like I know, like we talk about my Grammy and me picking up our prescriptions, and sometimes Mm. you know it's really good to be able to reach out to your family members and be able to do stuff for them, right? But one of the things that came up, like, in the Facebook post today that I was looking at is, like, what's kind of the way that, um, you know, people say, I'll slap the color off you or, you know what I mean, I'll slap you into next week. I know my Grammy always say, you want your face twisted. Can you all remember any type of phrases, like, from your Grammys or someone that would have been uniquely Bahamian that they used to say to you all the time? Well, I still have not figured out why lobster tail is red. But I know my mommy would say, I will show you what lobster tail red for all the time. (laughs) And I still don't know why. That that is the one that kind of sticks out. I love a juicy, eh? I know you got one. I'm thinking hard. I I know, like, high school. You was a good Charlie. Yes, man. I stopped getting (laughs) beaten or punished when I was seven, eight years old. I'm a nice boy. You know? oh, I, I'm thinking hard. I, I remember back in school, you said you got a cowboy in Texas, you know, in terms oh, of. Oh, boy. <laughs> that, no, no. Did he go? Mm. <laughs> you know? But no. So, Rowdy got a five, right? My the other day was spicy. Listen, my Grammy, I, I, I grew up. Um, for the most part uh, of, been my, of my life with my grandmother. And my grandmother was about, when she died, she and I were the same height, four feet, four inches. Young girl. Okay? And they used to call her Lil Russ, <laughs> nothing to trust. <laughs> <laughs> Everything in my Grammy mouth, my Grammy Ida, that's my maternal grandmother, she told my mother, she said, listen, you could take all that mother children out of this house, but I, she, me, I tell, the, tell her I ain't going nowhere. Mm-hmm. So she said, you red. She used to tell mommy, say, you red, red. <laughs> you supposed to take her out the house. So that was the first thing. Mm-hmm. Then she tell mommy one time, she said, yeah, I say, I believe rat eat your marriage papers. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Oh. 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 <laughs> yes. And then when she, and then my Grammy, she, listen, that was my heart. Ida May was my heart. Exuma woman. Mm. Right, she was a bullet before she got married, and then she she used to smoke a pipe with the tobacco in it, right? And her favorite True, word, and anybody used to mess with her was cock sucker. Yeah. Oh, I think we can say that on the edge, right? <laughs> I think that's how it came. Yeah, girl. 
She's on there. Yeah, she had a, listen, Mac, listen, Macintosh, before we ruin the mobile, this is Brad in your uh, eyes, ladies, Grouper. No, no, no. <laughs> he's, he's just looking at Stan. He's like, I'm enjoying this thoroughly. Yeah. I'm enjoying this thoroughly. Don't stop. Do you have any more? Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's only one more. Yeah. 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 So just, Justin, Justin didn't give his yet. Man, I, I was a good boy for most of my life, so I ain't had none of that. Don't stop lying. You also lie. I, I, I know my my other you relative. Trying to tell me only me used to get beaten for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yeah, no, sure. I always have yeah. to go pick the switch. I always have to pick the right switch, and my mouth still ain't soft to this day, so I don't even know if I do any good. Oh. That's, that's red girls' issues. <laughs> Red gal issues. Oh. That's what it is. Red gal issues. <laughs> when you end up getting them ridge mark all over you. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> but now you used to, to be proud of them because I'll show you how much it could take. <laughs> my, my Grammy never used to beat me. My Grammy didn't love me to death. Anything my great grandma used to beat me. I now. used to be right up underneath her gun tail. Every step she make, I was holding on to her dress. She used to make the best but um, big home, big bread in the world. I mean, my Grammy bread used to be so good till I used to sneak and pinch the dough, okay, and eat the dough. Now, I couldn't understand if she have it under the pan to rise, and I pinch a piece of the dough to eat the dough. How I get hell ho- hollering my name, telling me but pinching the dough. I can't get that. I thought the dough would have... You know what I'm saying? Right so on. I'm trying to this, this day, I said, she know I was teething the dough because I had to sit underneath the table. Just to pinch the dough, you know what I mean? And eat the dough just like that before the bread drink, bake, you know? And before she gave granddaddy his slice of that bread, she used to call me for my baked bread with butter. Mm. And I told wow. her, nice. my aunt Audley is guava duff. And nice. I also call, she had the best guava duff, I think, in the history of guava duff makers. Wow. Uh, wow. <laughs> you, you yeah. Can't. And he's still making a guava duff because I can need some of that little thing. That's my favorite dessert. Right on Cooper Stong. Cooper Stong Abaco. She's still nice. there. Okay. But Mr. I got- McIntosh, you're going to have to put some of them in the pharmacy, man. So when we, yeah. we pick enough. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love yeah. me some guava we, we can pick it up. I tell you one thing. All you have to do is tell um, this crew that are there that day. And I guarantee your payments will be coming through mobile assist yep. like crazy. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, we could be booking them out. Yeah. She's made the guava duff the old fashioned way. Yeah, with the cloth. You only know how to make it with the cloth. And mm. the sauce. The sauce now. That's that strain pulp. Now I don't know how she used to do the sauce. I only knew I saw a cloth, but yeah, I don't know how she did the sauce. Part. But then a lot of people nowadays they be getting all these fancy things with all kind of miracle whip and things. They cheat on the guava pulp. That's guava cake. Know, That's guava cake. That don't so count. You know, you know, you got to strain that guava, the seed. You got to get all that pulp, and then you add your little, your little um, vanilla and 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 so forth. Ain't too much, you no know, bunch of butter and all that stuff. You get the sauce flavor. Now, Old fashioned way, yeah. <laughs> nah, nah, ain't no parsley on that guava duffy because you know and some rum in that they just put a little rum in that you gotta put a little rum <laughs> as soon as we get a shipping company sign up with uh, mobile assist mobile assist that's mm. the full package right there Connection. right <laughs> but, well you know Mr. McIntosh we have like the full sales team now so I think that that's something we have to put on the list just for our benefit because I think everybody on this now want to go over there I know right yeah. <laughs> as long as there ain't no parsley on it as long yeah. as the parsley is I never understood the parsley though. What like why would you put Because somebody put parsley on that guava duff one day and, and um yeah. what was the guy's name? No. I think he, he made a big joke about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Quake. Yeah. Why well, never yeah. I was like, okay, so who was put like that they See? was just trying to be special and to be like, you know, we no, we behave and we need to be extra. It's being go- they yeah. like Mama Safi gourmet foods, all right? Mm. They they try to be gourmet, but they gourmet. didn't quite catch how to do it. <laughs> Lord, 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 Lord. You see now, don't, don't, don't see the next thing you know. CA got me in the trap CC. <laughs> <laughs> taking notes. Taking notes. Taking notes. Uh, yeah, you got me in the trap CC. Next thing you know. CC. Uh-huh. You see, because he's buying food off a of green parrot, but he ain't buying Mama Sassy stuff yet. I, I, got, uh-huh. I, I plan to I, use family, so I have no other choice but to get it. Now that I know it there, I order it now. I mm-hmm. order it now. Mm-hmm. And then you got to take that. Um, it's an exciting journey to the south side of the island. It is. Yeah. So you got to take that exciting journey to go see Mr. McIntosh, too. With yeah. Southside yeah. Neighborhood yeah. Pharmacy. And, you know, um, I, I make a joke about it because my dad lives in that area. And I, I always like, and that's where I grew up. 
So I know exactly how it is. But, you know, like I say, a little different, but as long as you know how to maneuver. Right, good. yeah. And then yeah. you got Mr. McIntosh right there to, to, to teach you the ways. Yeah. And if you need me, CA, yeah, man. Right. Yeah. Don't call my name, CA. Don't call my name. No, no. <laughs> I ain't sure what you can get into. I ain't sure what you can get into. Um, <laughs> I got a call, question. Call Mr. McIntosh. Yeah, warm I up. got a question for McIntosh. All right. Okay. Right? And I mean, I'm ashamed to say this, right? Okay. But here's the thing. You know, this COVID-19, a lot of people ain't get that time to be going around exercising. You know, like me, I, I, I get a little, little chunky around the midsection. You understand? Because mm. all I'm doing is staying home. But now everything on me aching. Mm. From my neck to my back and everything, and I didn't so. I listen. I I don't even wear perfume no more. My perfume is Tiger Balm. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Tiger Balm patched on my neck and things like this, and I scared to go to the doctor because right. guess what? I can needs to have me some cataflam because listen here, all in my neck, all in the back here is getting these knots and stuff like that. You sound like you what need to stretch. What do you recommend for people? Listen here, stretch. I can tell you, the only thing I do is stretch my foot out of the bed, oh, go Lord. into the kitchen, get something to eat, walk around the house once or two times, and that's that. So you get <laughs> the stiffness. You know what I mean? What would you okay. recommend? Do you carry, like, holistic stuff? Because I know in my cat of is need to go get doctor prescription and things Correct. for this, right? Correct. But for people like us who, you know, what would, what, would, what would you suggest over the counter that we could get that works kind of just as good as that cataflam or something? You know, the deal with that muscle thing, because then, listen here, that tiger balm, after a while, it's getting a little tired, that now it's burning your skin, you know? Mm. Right. Well, over the counter, which we use for, for uh, someone that just started working out, mm. is basically you just use a rub and over the counter, anti-inflammatories like a leaf, is a pretty good anti-inflammatory that's similar to cataflam that um because you know cataflam or thyroid you need a prescription but a leave is just as strong that you can get over the counter and you get like a rub they have some ones out there that that i don't smell like a tiger balm like bengay has like a greaseless scentless like one nah, they don't wait that's like pretty good as well uh so where where a wet tiger balm won't have to be your perfume, and you and you I can't have it on, and and uh and uh, nobody knows. So I would say a rub, a scentless rub that you use. But mm-hmm. when you're talking about an exercise routine, what minimizes the pain and a uh, discomfort is proper stretching before you actually work out, as well as and after staying it. hydrated. So once you stretch properly and stay hydrated with a lot of fluids, a lot of times the pain that you have after workout, there you go. Is it a severe? <laughs> <laughs> oh, big bottle of water. <laughs> right. See, see, listen, I the hydrating part I get down to a T, right? Because I have two types of hydration. Let me show you. <laughs> <laughs> I will show you the green one. You see, oh, what's green the second one? The diffuser. Uh, right. I have cucumber in it. I have uh, cucumber, sometimes celery. I have all kind of different things inside there. You what's know, the second one? Like Maybe a little apple cider vinegar and a little Correct. Uh, um, lemon juice, right? And then this is my second hydrator. Oh. Right. <laughs> That's actually would dehydrate you, but let's actually go with that. <laughs> <laughs> but let's but let's go with that. But it's it's good then. So um give us the, the WhatsApp number again, Mr. McIntosh, because even if people have questions like um Sherelle did, mm-hmm. they could ask you through the WhatsApp as well. Correct. Yeah. So it's basically the pharmacy at your fingertips. So any questions you have. If you want to get a price, if you want to get anything, you can ask us and we uh, answer you as quickly as possible. What was that, CA? I, know no, I, just, I, I, I was just amazed I could call for prices. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but that's what people normally do. They get the price before they come. So that's how you actually know if you could afford it or not, whether you have to come back, whether we can give an, whether we can give an alternative that may not be as costly. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, so you could ask for prices as well. So the phone number is eight one eight seven nine four six. Okay. 
818 And we're going to put all the y'all all information, right. you know, down in the lower thirds. And then we have someone, an next person joining us in on the ride. She met us here at the pharmacy and she is about to, you know, continue this nice long journey. We got a big car. Big car. It's, it's a big car. 50 in CD, you know. Be in a stretch limo. Be in a stretch yeah, limo. limo. I want the Hummer. You I want the Hummer with the pool in the middle. The, with the pool in the middle. You ain't got that kind of money. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how she know with the food. <laughs> so she be in the one I before. I watch TV. I watch TV. That's what it is. <laughs> but welcome, Andrea. Hey, Hello. Hi, everyone. What's happening? How are you? It oh, looks like y'all got this, the party started without me. <laughs> well, we know it was your birthday. We know it was your birthday um, coming up. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow so. oh, happy, happy, birthday. Birthday. happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. All I need to go get the bell. Hold on. Yep, yeah, and then we have um, Mr. McIntosh here from Southside Neighborhood Pharmacy. We have CA. We have Sh- um, Sherelle from Mama Sassy's. I don't know where Justin just did, but I think he wanted to get your cake or something. I don't know. Cowbell. Oh, oh, the cowbell. Yeah, you got to have to. You got to have to. We got to, you know, ring the bell for your birthday. Happy birthday. You got to cost me the bell too. Hold on, hold well, on, oh, baby, yeah, go baby. Get hold your, on, get your bell. Get oh, your God, ride the wave too. She got everything. They have bell. I have, I have bell too in them. Hold on, let me go get my ride. Go, hold on, hold on. Listen me up. I got two. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I appreciate you all. Thank you. This is probably the biggest party I'll have. You get your right. But, but Adrian, too. I could, I could wear the right. mask. And Janae's, you right. know, from Janae's. And then with our little brand and honor from over right. the And I could do my... Like that. Just like <laughs> I got, I got... I like it. That sounds good. <laughs> Happy birthday, Adrian. Thank you. Thank you, <laughs> But so, Adria, we were just talking with Mr. McIntosh um, from Southside Neighborhood Pharmacy, right? Yeah. And because I normally just run in no, from my ground. I had to go get the bell. And just get stuff. I was just telling Adria, like, because I run in from my Grammy and stuff, like, there's so much stuff that um, Mr. McIntosh can do. Like, we didn't realize that he could actually do um, recommendations over his phone through his WhatsApp um, chat. Yep. And also give pricing, and then um, Sherelle had the question about um, how it is that she alleviates some pain in her joints. So there's so much that they could do, and I know that you have a wide and a big family. So I just wanted to make sure that you knew that. I know you're going to be focused on it tomorrow, but come Monday, you know where yeah. to go. No, yeah, definitely. I didn't know um, like all those little tidbits. Like, and the thing is, for me, that adds to customer service, which is what it's all about. So that's yeah. great. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now, Mr. McIntosh, we can get a little wild. I don't know if you want to stay or you're going to go. I know if we got to go because we about to uh, bring on the best. I can see. If y'all get too wild, we about to I get the to ride. dip out. But exactly. let's go. <laughs> 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 so this is slide out. That's you're right. Slide you're right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I know, I know, Jervin, um, I know Jervin was going to... Um, pass back. Oh, Jervin, he messaging me now. So he can't get out. Justin, you got to fix that. No, tell him, come back in. Tell him, um, try to get okay, back in. Okay, hold on. Because Jervin is actually a part of the sales team that, yes. um, well, he's actually leading the sales team, I should say, that Mobile Assist has done. And what we're doing now is being able to do like that door-to-door service for um, business clients. So we've met a lot of our clients today and very interesting, very interesting people with a lot of great stuff. But yeah. We actually come down to you and we go through how the app works. We do the training. We make sure that you have all the information. And what I am, again, most proud of is the fact that all of the people that we spoke to today are Bahamian businesses. And we haven't even touched the surface of all of the businesses that are actually on mobile assist and using them for digital um, or using the, the platform for digital payments. It just does my heart proud, man. I tell you all, I, I, I'm a nationalist. I didn't even know that until recently, but I am. But see, I, I want to speak from a customer's point of view. Go I'm ahead, using see. mobile assist, right? Mm-hmm. It's easy to use, <laughs> you know? So yeah. there are times when I am, what I call bored and going through my phone and just playing with the mobile assist. And then you see a, a new business there and we say, hey, I didn't know they, they're, it's there. Boom. I order things now just because it's there. Right? Mm-hmm. And you yeah. should see me ordering things and say, okay, I'm coming now to pick up my stuff. Just because <laughs> how easy this mobile assist is. And it has so many businesses on it. So it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good tool for me. You know, so I tend to use it a lot. 
Yeah, that's true. And CA, I, I think like we have about um, 10 more businesses in the pipeline. Nice. Nice. Um, the sales team has grown from five because at one point we got to we, we, we were just so overwhelmed by all of the requests that we had to grow ourselves. And again, like Mobile Assist is a Bahamian company yeah. owned and yeah. operated by Bahamians. Mm-hmm. And again, like when you think about we, we normally think about certain industries um, as Bahamians, right? We think about farming. We think about agriculture. We think about fishing. Um, we think about, you know, different things. But a tech company. Typically, we don't really think along those realms, at least not when I was growing up. That was something that always was very foreign based. You, you know what I mean? And yeah. to have that type of talent to do the things that mobile assist can do. Download the app from Google Play or app, yeah. the App Store. Mm-hmm. By the time you download it and look through it, you you will not believe, and I know this sounds really terrible, but you won't even believe that it's Bahamian because of even the way that it looks. The functionality is just super Very slick. nice. It looks, very nice. And I don't mean to sound that way, but... Um, you know, Nuri, you know, because you was be ordering plenty. Like to say, I, I, order, I, I could say, I could actually confess and say, I order one thing at least a week via, yeah. via wow. mobile assist. At least, at least a week. What? So um, I should say, money is always on my on my mobile assist. Yeah, Real what, um, what <laughs> I appreciate is that fact of the ecosystem where you could basically whatever you spend physical cash on, whatever you want, you can actually purchase through the mobile assist app. Whether you want some groceries, you want medication, you want get whatever your heart desires, just go through your ecosystem. This store here, you can pay. And with the way the economy go, and everyone probably is going to be delivering soon. So literally, yeah. you can get sit home, go through your mobile assist app, and it's at your door. And so the possibility is, is just mind blowing where this app and this platform can actually take um, business um, in this country. So that's what I'm excited about for it. I think that's I the way to, to it. Here is here is what um, what. And, and I love that you said that because that was the reason why I signed on to uh, Mobile Assist. As a matter of fact, I have all of them. <laughs> all. I have all. I have the app store. I have the scan and pay. I have whatever else they have because she knows. Bill pay. Either the bill pay, either the route. Donate through SAC because I wouldn't get robbed without it if I didn't mention that again. Yes, right. <laughs> association, the SAC Alumni Association. Um, what I found um, for me as a small entrepreneur, see, I'm to the level you at yet Macintosh with my whole storefront, right? <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> yeah, but the thing is, and, and this is why I tell a lot of entrepreneurs and I push mobile assist. And I don't push it, you know, because I pay like everybody else, you know. But when I see a, the value in a product, and I could say, open my mouth and say that this is this and that is that. I am comfortable because anybody knows me knows that I'm a person of my word. OK, you may not like what come out of my mouth, but you're going to respect the words that I say, you know. So when I when I got on a mobile assist, you know, Selena, I ran, I put it through the ring up. I <laughs> She came at me and I was like, in my mind, you know, when somebody approached you and you just in the mood for hand nobody because you, not because, you know, you just had other things you was doing. And, then she, and I was so nice to her. Uh-huh. And I, you know, <laughs> I listened to her, but in my mind, I say, and this woman don't know as a person, right? You're trying to get this business off the ground. I get any time for anybody to talk foolishness in my head. I really need a gimmick right up and now, you know, because you think that's the first thing that comes to your mind. You think it's a gimmick. And so I threw a couple curveball questions at her, figuring now it would have throw her off course. And she's like, well, Miss Carter, what you want, we could do. Mm-hmm. However you want to set this up, we could do. You know, and then the thing is, I wanted to go ahead and get, um, you know, the the, the, the scanning through the thing through the bank where you could do the credit card payment. I wanted to get the little machine to do that and stuff. And then it was so high. And then on top of that, only I would be paying that fee whether or not I got a sale. You know, yeah. I was like, well, hey, hold on. This already too high. And by the time I finished paying to have this machine, and to just be able to conduct an, as a business starting out, I may not even get that many credit card transactions and these pop-ups in the first place. Mm-hmm. Right. It was not something I was willing to take on, but with scan and pay, I get all that functionality. 
All I do is I have my nice little card with the with the QR code on it. I put that in a nice solid frame on my on my table with my, when I display my product. People could go ahead and do that. It works like a charm over at Atlantis when I do the art walk at Marina Village. Mm-hmm. And so um, you see, the, the what I love about the product is the versatility. Mm-hmm. So yes. I have my app store. Um, I can add my products to it. I can go ahead and use the scan and pay to collect credit card payments, something I couldn't do because plenty of times, I ain't going to lie to you, I lost a lot of money. Exactly. When people only had credit card, I lost money. And I was like, well, Jesus, the only sale I get sometimes, you know when you're doing these pop-ups, mm-hmm. sometimes the sale, the only sale that may come your way, uh, uh, depending on where, where the event is held, make mm-hmm. me a credit card transaction. If you can't take that, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you lose, you know? And so I love that about mobile assist, and then I love the behind the scenes stuff because you can tell you can attest to this Macintosh behind the scenes. The information you get about your customers, all uh-huh. that. All you get that. all you get a mailing list, so you could now if you want to do your little discount, you could offer these people discount. Not only you get your mailing list, you get your demographics on the kind of people that use your product. So if you need you to can tailor whatever promotion, all of that. You know, and, and, and like I said, a start, and then on top of that, you ain't got to worry about the money you collect through that app because that's your financial statement right there. You ain't got to be trying to put nothing together at the, you know what I mean, at the end of the month. Just one that's cookie. Loaded, and right right into QuickBooks, right? <laughs> it's, it's, it's pretty See, and good. People yeah. don't understand that. They don't understand that, you know, because when you, well, me starting out, I don't want that extra headache. I'm trying to build a brand. Why do I want to now try to be dealing with financial? I got to be the marketer. I got to be the the, 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 the the accountant. I got to be all of these things wrapped in one. And I got a whole mobile assist platform that could do all of that for me. And sorry, sorry, not platform. Ecosystem. 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 You live in Right. 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 I got a whole ecosystem now. I have to say, sorry, sorry, Cheryl. I have to say, Adria. You know your product, right? The, the, the company that, um, that you, you work for is doing what it's supposed to be doing when, as the marketing people, you don't have to say nothing, right? And then the, cli- <laughs> the, clients, and the clients just like literally have told you everything that you need to know about that. I mean, yeah. we, we, as a, we, we, we I, I'm telling you, like, we didn't even have to be here. Y'all, I could go and then I come back and then y'all go. <laughs> no, it just, no, it just really exciting. Oh, yeah, it speaks for itself. It's really exciting. Hey. You see, do you know too that you could do polls through mobile assist? I uh, we yes, a questionnaire I'll, to see how people satisfy with your program, your products, yep. and your, your company assist. And you know you could even put your little discount on your banner with your storefront. Yes, I know that. I um I haven't dabbled with it as yet, but I knew it. But I knew it is available. But I haven't done it as yet. Listen, Adrian and I going down to um, Macintosh Tuesday because Macintosh don't call me and ask me what I'm dealing with. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Macintosh and Raggy, right. you Because yeah, you know, that's to be your top. She know I don't. And when when you know when they introduced that scan and pay, she didn't tell me that right away. Because mm. I know what she was gonna do, Sherelle. I must admit. <laughs> like the QR code thing, I was not the best. Like I needed like a, a course and what the QR code was. Right. But once you figure out what it is, it makes the process a whole lot easier. Yes. Once you it's understand all they have to do it. Is yeah. Download the app. Once they download yeah. the app and they turn on the camera and they scan that, that take them right to, to your page. Yep. Yeah, and so. then and then the beauty of that as well is that you know the training is ongoing so you know certain businesses have turnovers and justin i think like even for um like the persons that you may hang around with that mm-hmm. would want to start their own businesses this takes so much of the cost away from a young aspiring entrepreneur to be able to be financially viable in terms of being able to accept those digital payments not even like i know macintosh has a storefront and um, Mama Sassy's with um, Sherelle doesn't, mm. but they are able to do business the same whether way. they have a storefront or not. So whatever your business model, it works for you. And we do the training. We come mm. down and even if you have um, staff turnover, we come down and we make sure that you have everybody up to speed, whoever's going to be using the app mm. um, to conduct the transactions. We do the training as well. So 
I think that the reason that our clients can speak so well about the product is definitely because the training was available to them, even though Sherelle is around me all the time. I got one more and thing to comment. Macintosh, have you uh, or anybody in your team, when you received, um, uh, <laughs> when you received um, payment for a product through the app and, and, and one of your staff didn't readily risk or, or, or promptly, that's the word I should use, promptly respond to <laughs> the, 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 the request. Uh-huh. Did you get that call on the phone? <laughs> no, you know, I, like, I, like, I haven't had, like. You got it. You got it. Yeah, I, yeah. So his staff are on point, Sherelle. His staff yeah, is literally <laughs> process their orders on time. Only yeah. you would be playing with me. Yeah, <laughs> I have <heard. laughs> Let me give you the joke. Let me give you the joke. No joke. Because, I mean, I'm a one-stop shop. I got to go in the kitchen. I got to make my products. I got to package them, label them, all that stuff myself, right? And sometimes I might even be into, you know, being on no phone or whatever the case may be. And mind you, I did add a ping, right? I did add a ping, but right. I really wasn't paying too much attention to it. I didn't bother to follow up like that. All I hear, Miss Cartwright, Miss Cartwright. Now, um, you got an order, and 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 um, that was quite a while ago. Um, could you just go ahead and oh. uh, <laughs> <laughs> because they do that, they call you up, they call mm. you up, they say, Well, you know, use Rawas for the brand now, we can't have you costing the brand, so. all right. <laughs> but what I must say about about our mobile assist team, there was any questions that I've, that I've had, and I've had like a lot of questions. I've, you know, any question that I've had, they've always f tried to find a way to get an answer for me. Even if they may not know right then, they'd be like, okay, let me get back to you. And they always respond to satisfy my, I guess, questionable mind. So yeah. I really appreciate the team because they really are a support to your business. So yep. yeah, it, it's definitely Thank been a, a relationship, right? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Selena, Selena always says that um, we haven't met a business yet that we can't solve because the app is so multifunctional. There is some way we could help you out. Yeah, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. And, I and even um, sorry, I was gonna say, C. A. Nuri, like um, C. A. Nuri, you know Dr. Moxie who leads um, yes. Yes. that side of the team. I have never seen a mind like Dr. Moxie. Detail. In my life. Detail. In my life. I have, have a 25 seen... step plan. <laughs> yes. And, and, and you might only even get to hear, even when he speaks to you with the level of detail and um, what it, he puts into it. Like when we can answer Mr. McIntosh or um, Sherelle from Mama Sassy's, the first place we go to is Dr. Moxie. They say, ah. Uh, and Dr. Moxie breaks it down so simply about how the yes. tech is being used. I love to hear. I, I keep telling them you need to be on a TED Talk. But listen, all, yes. all you know, when you get a chance, Google the engineer mind. Mm. Mm. And you would find that people who have that degree when it comes to engineering, they um, there's actually, there actually was an FBI study. Oh Lord. Based on these type of individuals. <laughs> My name didn't come up as sure. <laughs> no, honestly. If you, you Google it or you look it up, there was an FBI study. Okay, done a, a profile done on these particular type of mindsets. And and it was so eerie because it was it was so on point. You know, so you, you find that, I mean, you know me, I like to dissect all kinds of stuff, but um, it was really interesting to read up on that type of individual. So I'm elaborating on that because what and I then do love And yeah, the TA probably have a whole different perspective too. I, yeah, my my perspective I, is always from the customer point of view, you know, because right. I use the app to shop, you know. Mm -hmm. And, and, you know, and bonus again. Yes, and, <laughs> and and just recently, I was by a friend house um, who wanted food, and this is before they opened up all these other places, and and I 
just out of them uh, having, uh, having a conversation, she got excited and said, oh, I, I, I see this new thing. I'm not sure if you ever heard about it. And I can order green powered food. So I already knew it's mobile assist, right? So I'm mm-hmm. smiling to myself. He said, you already know what this is what everyone's using now, you know? And we can order food and I can get a bear and a girl through the whole thing, right? And I said, do you have any money on your account? Oh yeah, I'm going to put money and I open my book. Here's my money. What we'll, we we'll ordering now, you know? Like I said, I always have money mm-hmm. on my mobile assist. I'm always ordering. Um, I, I, I am the culture. So going to the True True Bohemian festivals and stuff, I find that it's easy to top up money before I go to these festivals. And when I go and, and I go to Boots to Boots, you know, you just scan and pay. Just scan and pay. So I don't have to worry about, particularly when you know you have to buy, you buy the fake money now when you go to yeah, the festivals. Yeah, the festival yeah. dollars. Yeah. Yeah. Festival yeah. dollars. That lag is be long. Yeah. You know? So coming in and time, not but... having to go through that again to get this festival dollars and having my money on my mobile assist already. I'm able to scan and pay. And then you'd be, you'd be the envy of everybody. Everybody was looking at you. What are you doing? No, no, yeah, no, 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 cool. And then I cool. find at there those events, people have, um, at least they've told me that they've been able to quote unquote save money because they can set a limit. You know, yes. if you only load up $50 yeah. or whatever, yes. you say, okay, this is yes. what I'm spending at the festival. When it's mm-hmm. done, it's done. It's done, yeah. yeah. Yes. And Adrian, that don't ever work for my teenagers. <laughs> it's 15 out of this B70. But it, again, like you do have that time of flexibility, right? Like to be able to set a limit or say, okay, well, I know if I set it at 50, I know it'll be 70 in the back of my mind. I may tell my children it's 50, but we, we, we know what it is. <laughs> you gotta start low. <laughs> yeah, you gotta low ball it sometimes. CA, since I got you on this line, I I, I know I got to tell you this too. <laughs> and since you don't tell me how you got money on that mobile assist. Oh, Lord, here you know, it come. I listen. I listen. You know you are an alumnus of, of where? St. Augustine's College. Only Braceskin people go to SAC. You call Sam Lewis with the, the, the JA competition. I might as well tell you CA was you. With me? It was you. Has an app on there because yes. we we use Macintosh. We use the donation um, platform as well. Okay. Look at so, it now. I, I have to I'm shake my hair with the sock president. thing because my wife is a sock alumnus and I hear this like every day. Oh. Oh. Get down. So go ahead. So, continue. That's what? so Macintosh, two things. Since I got the two of y'all, one. I Macintosh, you was a, no, hold on. Macintosh, you was a soccer or you, 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 you No, my wife. No, no, no. No, you say his wife. Oh, Macintosh, your wife is a soccer. Oh, I lose. My Ain't none of y'all going to J.A.? Ain't none of y'all going to J.A.? Macintosh, the first uh, thing is, um, I need you, I can call that number and I can send you a little thing because what we have done with the Alumni Association is we're trying to establish a business network. And so we're partnering with businesses on our alumni website. You can go ahead and advertise. We give you, we allow you to do, um, to advertise your business on our alumni website in exchange for you to offer maybe some kind of discount or some kind of incentive program that you would offer to our alumni who pay their dues. So if you say, for instance, um, we have, um, we have several uh, businesses like, Hair Life, which um, which was Dr. Kim Scriven, she um, gives a 15% discount to all our alumni if they need to get their hearing tests done. And then uh, she also gives um, 10% discount off of the hearing aids. Um, we have um, a few uh, people. We have um, we have um, Dr. Um, who does the colonoscopy? We have uh, we have um, businesses, and, and these are not just businesses that are just SAC alumni businesses. These are businesses that are you know whatever it is that wish to sign up and join our program. We don't tell you what you offer, but it's just a whole a, a way of networking to get our people um, utilizing uh, first of all paying their dues and being able to go to certain um, business partners to mm. get discounts, which also encourages people coming to support your business as well. Since you know your wife is a soccer, we 8,000 strong. Strong. I'm counting. I'm counting. I need to pay my $60. What are you trying to say for the year? Yes, you need to pay your $60. 
Also on the, um, through the uh, mobile assist platform, you can, um, ecosystem, sorry. Ecosystem. Correct. <laughs> mobile assist ecosystem, you can go ahead and purchase alumni merchandise. Yep, I see that pin, loan red. Okay, now <laughs> guess what? And guess what? You know, you know, with that J competition, you know. Don't start. Yeah. You know, start. You know, I'm right. not. Hey, who, who was wrong? Who was wrong? <laughs> They beat us by what? How much y'all beat us by? I can beat you by I can beat you by a dollar. The fact is I beat you. Now you know I petty and I competent. I can yeah. it. <laughs> I beat you by twenty five cents a cent. I still beat you, and that's all it is. Is number one is number one. Like how they oh, rob Bali. Yeah. Just like how they rob Bali. <laughs> yeah, they did rob the Bali. I'll have to say that they did rob the Bali, but Jay did not rob Sar. Mm -hmm. right. <laughs> it was a great competition. It was That's a great competition. It was. And you know, it was a great way for um, both organizations to raise funds for these great community causes. Um, Jay is very youth organ um, based. I know that um, SAC does a lot of work as well, even with great commissions. So it, it's like all of the funds, even though we have me and Sherelle, like I say, we petty together, we competitive oh, yeah. together, and we love each other, but we just route. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> when we come to like the SAC and the JA stuff, but yes. everything went where it was supposed to go. And if it takes me and Sherelle being feisty, as we call it, um, then we can make sure that we oh, raise sassy. the fun. That yeah. sassy. She's sassy. <laughs> yes, I'll be feisty then. <laughs> we, went through, we went through a whole thing trying to get people to come and donate. You know, we mm -hmm. were a whole. I mean, and it's like, boy, look at him, like, where all my sackers are, all these people playing crazy. And she starts showing, uh, you know what she was doing? She was sending me these memes from um, <laughs> Game of Thrones with the woman with the, I'm talking but shame. shame. And what happened to sack? Shame. She was throwing, listen, she was throwing more shade in my face, but shame, <laughs> shame. You know, and I'm like, okay, you know what? This girl, listen, and I had to <laughs> I said I was going to wait up because the deadline was 11 o'clock in the night. I said I was going to wait up until 10.59 and then if I had to go on my own thing, I was going to make a, a, another deposit. Right. <laughs> and fall, you know, I fall asleep, right? That's how oh, she went. Because I didn't know. Gotta be true to <laughs> is it what they say, the turtle and the hair? Because I was up too. You see? I was up too. Mm -hmm. I, you guys did have Sherelle talking to me by the next day. Not for me. Not burning that out for one good child. Mm -mm. Yes, oh, we daughter. Competition. We can need to be able to see in real time when these donations moving. We up. can do that, and, and that's something that Adria and, and I can work on in terms of like the thermometer to make sure that we have everything in real time. And I showed that on live on our alumni page. Listen here, soccer's don't like lose. You know, we 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 the crown. We don't lose one. I don't know. You know how many people that come through JA? You know, Jay is five thousand students a year. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. come on, man. Our alumni network so we can turn this yeah. into no smack talking like the WWF. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know, you know yeah. me and you carry on dead vibe. We can't do it. In we fact, can't do it. My but. first introduction to business was was our true IJ. Yeah. I mean, in fact. Well, there you go. Now there that I see, see yeah. now, Mr. McIntosh, the next competition. I don't expect they have nothing. Sure, I can't talk to you. Give her your wife number. <laughs> Don't even listen to what she have to say no more. That, that, that's it. That's done. That that done. Right, but, right, yeah. um, but I'm thinking <laughs> that um, and Adrian and I <laughs> all right, Sherelle, but no, what, what y'all doing with SAC is, is really great with the business network. And I'm thinking that maybe Adrian and I can have a little chat about this and see maybe if there's some type of mobile assist incentive that we can do. Yeah. Um, for both CJ uh, alumni as well as the SAC oh, alumni, right? We do have that. Um, we to have to that. make sure, yeah. But like, let's let's see how we could revisit that so that all of the the um, persons that have come up through again a really great school, um, a really great youth organization can benefit because you know we foster these types of things. We foster, I know with JA, we foster um, the entrepreneurship spirit. So maybe there is something that Mobile Assist can do. Actually, Mobile Assist does. Mobile Assist gives us um, what Mobile Assist has agreed to give us is a twenty-five um, percent discount um, on the set of fees for scan. Well, of course, I know that already. I tried to talk with some people. Okay, we'll call it you again know. then, and I can just give that to you. And when I give it to Jay, don't be mad. Don't Martin be mad. Josh got to know. <laughs> Martin Josh got to know. You know, right. see, he got to know. He don't know this. 
<laughs> right? So mobile is just give us 25% discount because your wife may have a business. Mm. And when she pay her dues, she may want to use that 25% discount. Mm. Adrian, okay. check the records, please, because you know Sherelle. Check the records. Go back into the files. <laughs> 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 oh, man. But there, there is definitely something that we can make sure that is yeah, um, more like widely known yeah. um, to make sure that we, you know, because like you said, Bahamian economy is something that we need to kind of bring up now and we need to support it. And whatever way mobile assist can do it, you know, we're there for it. Obviously, we need to pay the bills as well, keep the lights on. But whatever we can do, we will. So I think that um, that's our commitment to soccer. So CA, you know, thanks yeah. thanks for not getting like too involved and ganging up no, on no, me. No, no, I differ from Sherelle. Yeah. We have this row too, and in WhatsApp, we have this row too. So let's talk about Trino. I gotta tell you this. I gotta tell you that story off private uh, privately. Yeah. <laughs> but Gerard, I actually I can go now. Yeah, because I want to hear the story. <laughs> oh, man. I will hear the story but TA thank you again for coming in thank you everybody right. for coming in I know um, I mean, but before we end I know I gotta run oh sorry Justin before I have to go the whole everybody gotta take their right cause we get your right oh, my <laughs> <Adrian>. <laughs> get you have to get your car bill and we gotta swing the right swing the right swing the right <laughs> <laughs> Cause that's how you do a night out and thank you all for coming everything cool thanks Selena happy birthday by the way happy birthday thank you and you this was buy cool the mama sausage jam and have it delivered through the app yeah man I can do that I can do that I can do that <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> hey. but you know thank you all for coming to everything cool and oh yeah follow the page all y'all send me all y'all um, details um Probably through Selena and she could send that to me. I'll tag all y'all and all the posts I make. This is great. We got to do it again. Maybe in person in a stretch Hummer. While we, you know, more yes. friendly dressed. Yeah, the, the, the boat, the boat, the boat, the boat. I, I, I'll, go, I'll go the whole pool thing. Um, Mr. McIntosh, she wasn't there with Mr. Morris. Okay, we go on the boat. boat. Yeah, oh, we Mr. Morris brought up the boat. We on the boat. McIntosh, all us, we're going to do uh, a mobile assist customer network. Correct. Mm. So we all could come together, network, and see how we can help each other um, with our businesses and stuff like that. Yes. Anything I do, gotta have food now. So we can have the food, even if I gotta bring little things and things. I worry yeah. that. <laughs> well, you do when you launch in the um, the platters with the crackers and the the the, um, the the jellies and the jams. That's fine, and then we can get Mr. Mori. And we have our so, um, berries too. And berries. Um. Yes, and berries. Yes. Which reminds me, who have my food? You better call on berries. Or, oh no, <laughs> no. food from Green Power. Right. I have free food today. I have to get my free food from Green Power right. before I call on. But you know, I can't buy on berries anyway tomorrow. So. Yeah. Man, listen, I'm a w. Tell you, see, ya, you ain't try on berries on Meadow Street, eh? Uh, no. I, 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 I'm picturing Meadow Street now, and I don't see it. Okay, you know, we only could add tonight. West. It's Meadow Street or Meadow Lane. Mm-hmm. We only could add West on yeah. Meadow Street. After you pass Hospital Lane, yeah. there's a bar on the right side. I think it's maybe about 300 feet or whatever. I barred with distance, but it ain't too far. Bar is still bar, open? Right? Go ahead. I don't know if the bar is still open because I don't go in the bar. Pick up and deliver it, you get to the bar, Before you get to the bar, there's a little yard there. Okay. Where you could get on Betty's um, food. You'd see the big red um, 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 thing I'm building um, with, with um, on Betty's. It's opposite the preschool. So I know the preschool is. Okay, so right opposite, and you know the preschool is right a little ways up from Hospital Lane, heading west. Yes. And then they also, like I say, they're going to do um, Bar on the Go, which is also in that same um, building. Mm-hmm. Is gonna be doing a special Mama Sassy's inspired drink. Okay. Okay. Drink. Nice. <laughs> okay. So we getting the stuff together with networking because we show in the vers- versatility of Mama Sassy's products. When Mama Sassy be doing a book, a cookbook. Listen, we working on that right now. That is I like. Awesome. I like make jam. I like make jams. But I give you the jam recipe now. You ain't getting it. <laughs> I, 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 I was wondering what CA was there for because you know what you're talking to me. If I give you my jam recipe, then I need to sell it. 
Okay, there you go. <laughs> but this right? is good. You can't get that. You know, now I can give you a recipe. I can show you how to make other kind of jam. Okay. Not what I care. No you problem. Hey, y'all, y'all know what it is. What is it called? Justin, the, 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 Justin well, what are you just called? The, the, the after party? And CA got to get on the phone and, and talk. Right. He's talk for Jesus. So. Yeah. Oh. I know you got to go. Because uh, she's so, she talking about making see, jam that the, she don't care. <laughs> yeah, that, that's right. <laughs> uh, I'm like, I want to go, but I can't yeah. go because I'm too meditated. <laughs> I'm like, the jam <laughs> after the jam. <laughs> we gotta but cut yeah, the well, show. You know we gotta go. go. We gotta go. Right. <laughs> I can catch right. y'all, y'all later. That's been good. Right. Just we gotta... Let's go. Bye. See y'all later. Bye. Bye.